வெல்கம் டு எஸ்விஆர் ஐஏஎஸ் அகாடமி கமான் இந்தியா டாட் காம் இஸ் அவர் வெப்சைட் இன் டுடேஸ் கரண்ட் அஃபேர்ஸ் ஆன்லைன் வீடியோ லெக்சர் யூ வில் லேர்ன் அபவுட் இந்தியா சைனா ரிலேஷன்ஷிப் த டாபிக் இஸ் கமிங் இன் ஜிஎஸ் பேப்பர் டூ ஃபார் மெயின்ஸ் டுவெண்ட்டி சிக்ஸ்டீன் ஜிஎஸ் பேப்பர் டூ இந்தியா சைனா ரிலேஷன்ஸ் இஸ் ஒன் ஆஃப் த எக்ஸ்பெக்டட் ஏரியா அண்ட் ப்ரிப்பேர் தரவலி ஆன் திஸ் டாபிக் எஸ்பெஷலி த சைனாஸ் blockage of india's entry into the nuclear suppliers group and masood azhar issue and un security council committee 1267 and other topics like brahmaputra river and china constructing a dam across the tributary of brahmaputra and its implications on india so these are the important areas for the 2016 as examination on india china relationship So let's start the video lecture on this topic. In this article, let's discuss about India-China relations. The dragon and elephant can live peacefully and can coexist peacefully. This article contains important points. Whenever you write about India-China relations, india china relations in gs paper 2 you should use some common words like it's a relationship between new delhi and beijing it is a relationship between asia's first and third most economies so asia's biggest and third biggest economies and another point is that it is a relationship between world's largest communist nation world's largest communist nation and world's largest democratic nation these are the important points you should write while writing answers on india china relationship china is the world's largest communist nation whereas india is the world's largest democratic nation and also you can write india china relationship is the relationship between world's first and second most populous nations china is the most populous nation at present and india is the second most populous nation at present china's population at present is about 145 crore population and india's population is about 120 plus according to the various reports by the year 2025 china is going to replace sorry india is going to replace china as the world's largest nation in terms of population this article deals about dragon and elephant relationship and both can join their hands and can coexist peacefully whenever you write answer about india china relationship use the word dragon for china and use the word elephant for india various political experts call that india and china cannot coexist peacefully because experts say that both india and china are emerging economies and both are looking for the natural resources and both countries have 100 crore plus population so to feed the their huge population both are looking for the natural resources and for development both are fighting each other but according to the another set of experts both countries dragon and elephant can coexist peacefully china at present the global leader in manufacturing china achieved whereas india is the global player in the service sector india is the global leader in the service sector whereas china is the global leader in the manufacturing so china followed a traditional route usually economy moves from agriculture to manufacturing 
then from manufacturing to the service sector indian economy is an exception it moved from the agriculture to the service sector and in the last few years government of india is taking so many steps to make india as a manufacturing nation the steps like make in india and other steps are taken in this regard the article says that india and china both are two of the oldest civilizations in the world this point also you can write in the mains examination on the india china relations apart from that so by using our culture traditions both countries can exist peacefully as a jain neighbors in mains 2016 examination if you get any question on india china relations two issues you must quote about mazur mazud azhar issue and beijing's blocking the india's membership bid at the nsg is a second point and third point is the tributary of brahmaputra where china is planning to construct the most expensive hydro power project so these three points you must write while writing answer on the recent developments in india china relations to get a complete video lecture on india china relations visit our website comeonindia.com to get a pdf of this video lecture you can also visit our kind of s section